Hello, April 20th here, Happy Dog Farm. And uh, I thought I'd done a video on my rain gauge, but apparently I haven't. This is supposedly a National Weather Service approved rain gauge. I got it on Amazon. What gave it credibility is it does have a national stock number, which to me from old days means a lot. Let's see if I can get this to focus for you. There you go. A product of Productive Alternatives Inc. More information, I'll put a link to Amazon where I got it. What I really like about this gauge is it's easy to take apart, it's tough, it's surviving the winter well, and most notably, it's designed so that you can read um, very small fractions, hundredths of an inch of rainfall. That's like a big deal. And when you look at it and you know how to read a graduate, the meniscus, you know right away this thing is working well. Okay, so this is it. Now, we got snow the other day. It was filled with ice. I did not want it to crack. So I popped the top and the graduate took about, and I took it and I was able to flip it over to hang it and just flip it over in its stand and just leave it out here upside down. I don't usually leave it out for the winter, but for a day or two, that was a really good, you know, that was a good solution. So anyway, I like this thing. It works well. It's affordable, it's durable, it's accurate, it's precise. Wow, it's got a lot going for it. Anyway, sorry for my shaky handholds. Uh, if you're looking for a rain gauge, especially if you're keeping track of rainfall both for soil moisture and also if you're running Mary Blight. You know, you come out in the morning, you don't see dew, but you look in the rain gauge, oh wow, there's something in there. So then you record it, you know, you had a wedding period during the evening. So there you have it, my rain gauge, information down below. It's a nice rain gauge. Talk to, oh yeah. And that's just my little work stand where I keep books and stuff in there. So when I go into the orchard, um, I don't have to go back to the house and I just put stuff back in there. Okay, take care, bye-bye.